what interventions are best for our change initiative. An intervention is a planned activity aimed at bringing about improvements in an organization. There are at least four broad categories of interventions. Strategic interventions involve changes to the organization's vision, strategy, culture, or structure. For instance, we might create a new vision or make changes to the culture's diversity practices. Social interventions make changes to social systems, like selection, training, and performance management. We might implement a new mentoring program or use validated testing procedures. Structural interventions make changes to the division of labor, reporting relationships, and workflow. We might redistribute or outsource job responsibilities. Technological interventions make changes to tools, equipment, and information processing systems. We could change the ergonomic design of workspaces or implement a paperless inventory system. Within each of these categories, there are hundreds of different options. Rely on multiple interventions to boost your success rate. Let's look at some of the specific interventions you might consider. Process consultation is a process that seeks to help people and organizations help themselves. It isn't telling them what to do or persuading them to buy a specific service. It's about teaching them how to solve their own problems. Encourage the organization to own the change problem and the solution. Always try to be helpful, not an expert. Stay in touch with reality and rely on the evidence. Assess your ignorance or the things you don't know. Organizational learning is the process of using the past to make improvements at the organizational level. Learning organizations use five activities to bring about change. First, solve problems systematically. Rely on the evidence and teach everyone how to use an evidence-based framework. Second, encourage experimentation with new ideas to develop complete understanding of a phenomenon. Next, learn from your and others' past experiences. The fourth activity is to transfer knowledge through reports, videos, training, and job rotation. The final activity is to measure learning through surveys, interviews, and direct observation. Coaching is the process of helping others grow and develop through a variety of techniques. Prescribing means giving directions or recommendations to the learner. Informing means giving information to the learner. Confronting means challenging the learner's assumptions and bringing blind spots to their attention. Cathartic interventions help the learner release emotions such as fear and anger. Catalytic interventions help the learner discover something about themselves and learn to solve problems on their own. Supporting means building the learner's confidence. How can we decide which intervention is best? The four-frame model can help. It identifies four different frames or ways of thinking about organizations. View each intervention through each frame. How does this intervention impact the way work is organized and structured? the way relationships are developed and nurtured, the way power and influence are developed and used, and the way culture gives meaning and purpose to work. As you can see, determining which intervention is best is not an easy task, but there are plenty of options from which to choose. With experience, managers can become skilled interventionists.